Well, 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 we got a nice little wreck right here. I got the call from the official police garage, heavy duty division. Apparently this has been here for a few hours. I don't know why they lagged in calling me, but there's a vehicle, believe it or not, all the way to the back. I'll zoom in right now. And they got a flatbed and rough for that. It's perfectly on its side. Almost in a comical position. And I can say comical because there's no fatalities and no major injuries, luckily. But that, uh, that's the car right there. I don't know who hit who. It's a job for insurance. My job is just to clear this. So I got Joe in route with the Lando. He's right behind me on a forklift. That's where this load is going to be transported. Probably the, the tractor too. And let me go on the other side to show you why. This is why. No front axle. And the rear axle is all jacked up right there. So you can't front or rear tow this. Debris everywhere. Uh, I'll help Joe drop the forklift as soon as he backs up here. We'll get this load off. I'll split the tractor from the trailer. Sky it, put it on the land all. And then I can just focus on this ugly debris. <sighs> I got a fun one ahead of me. Alright. How to jump up there real quick to get my tanker tube set up. It doubles as like a, almost a spreader bar. It's great for picking up tractors by the engine frame. It's called a tanker tube and I have yet to use it on a tanker. Had a tanker once and nope, did not fit. So soon hopefully. I'm just right here getting set up. I won't be doing any physical lifting until Joe gets here. They had him down the street where it's blocked off so they're going to open up that lane for him so we can get here. You see why? It's because all that load, as soon as I move the tractor, that it's going to make a, more of a mess. The load's going to fall off, so we'll have Joe with the forklift tackle that. But in the meantime, I can at least prep. Kill two birds with one stone. These are my frame grab hooks. I really, really, really like these. Grab hooks are not meant to go like on frames or edges. These though are. And Joe is here. I'll go help him drop the forklift right now. Bam, brought the three axle land all. What's up Joe? We got a good one or what? So check it out, man. We'll drop, we'll drop the forklift, and we'll focus on that load. It's pretty easy, man. Once you get that load up on the front, yeah. That's a good one. Yes, it is. It's a very good one, Joe. Believe it or not, no injuries. But yeah, man. Once you get that load off the front, I, I could safely. Uh, I already split the tractor. I'll oh, be able to set the tractor on the lower point. You can totally That's the exactly it. Yes, but we need the forklift so we can take care of that load. And they got environmental coming for uh, the spill. All right. You got your work cut out, Joe. So Joe had a good idea. I don't know why I wanted to uh, when he takes off that load to put it back inside of the of his land all. But since the tractor's gonna go there, he figured he could just reload this trailer, and I tow it like that. So good suggestion, Joe. There you go. So Joe had the bright idea to use the forklift to just reload this trailer. My original plan was to put this load onto the land all, but um, yeah, it's not necessary if Joe can reload this trailer because this tractor is going to go on that land all due to the front and rear busted axle so good thinking Joe easy peasy hey the foundation from uh hey how easy is it to pick because it looks like it buckled underneath huh? hmm. not bad you got it Joe 
Where's your coffee, by the way? I need my coffee. Yeah, I got uh, I got Celsius in the fridge. Oh, that's what I need. And Red Bull. So while Joe does that, I had mentioned earlier, kill two birds with one stone. Focus set. I got my tanker tube slash lifting beam up front. I've got it secure. This is what's super cool about these uh, frame grab hooks. They go to the frame. By the way, while Joe fixes the load with the forklift, let me introduce to you the world's first convertible Dodge Ram TRX. Ain't that a sight for sore eyes. And before you ask, yes, the driver is fine. The driver of both vehicles. I'm not sure what caused the accident, but man. I got a buddy of mine, Sean Van Lingen, who owns one of these, and they are powerful trucks. Safe to say that speed was a factor in this. Now obviously uh, the crash didn't cause it to be perfectly cut like that fire department had to extract the guy with the jaws of life. One boy is lucky he lived this one with no gravely injuries, but man, this car's like what, 80, 90,000? I believe they're still going above sticker price. Not this one, you'll be seeing it at Copart very, very soon. Well, the local light duty company showed up right now and uh, flipped it. Looks like they use a stinger to push it back over. What a sight, huh? The world's first convertible TRX. <gasps> Jojo's hammering down over there. So as soon as he gets the back of that flatbed trailer loaded up, I'm already rigged. I just throw in the chains on the rear axle and it's go time. It's crazy, you would never think that the driver lived, man. It, it does look worse because the roof's cut off. <laughs> Fire department did that to extract the guy. But that's one less TRX on the market. Well, it looks like we'll be here for a while. The environmental company is still not here. So, what do you think, Hulk? Another hour? You don't know. Let's check on JoJo. So these things are not bundled properly. <laughs> Silly Joe. All right, so these things are not bundled properly, which is giving Joe a big issue. The rotator would make an absolute mess of this. So a forklift is still the best option. Almost done, Joe? Almost. That's right here. Three little baby ones. Got dark fast, homie. Got dark real fast. Real quick. Coffee Best time. Look, because it got dark. It's getting darker faster. I threw on the... Uh, 20 millimeter f1.8 Sony lens. I love this baby. Let's go check out Joe's work. Someone's getting a bonus tonight. Looks like he's staging all this stuff here so I can really quickly do the track to lift when it's ready. I still got the TRX over there. Four vehicle. My goal is to get this thing airborne before environmental gets here. Make it easier for them. That right there that Joe's scooping up, that's the door for the TRX, believe it or not. For that Dodge Ram about 50 yards up ahead, that's the door. I think Joe's gonna be a uh, help a Honda and take it to them. Crazy. In fact, when I first got here, this is, I had to move this to back up. That's the tire. 
for the TRX. It looks like the TRX, from what I'm, I'm talking to the guys here that seen, hit this head on and sideswiped it, boom, 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 took all that out. Did this too, I mean, there's quite a bit of damage. He did that too. You can see how benty, how bent that is. Oh, he's lucky to be alive, I'll tell you that. Oh, and there's something you don't see every day. The driver showed up to the scene to retrieve property from his truck. Proof that the driver is okay. And Joe just got in my way. Hey, hey, hey. That's the driver right there in the blue shirt to the left behind the trailer. Looking for the keys in his truck. Well, thank God he's okay. Same with the driver of the TRX. over here <laughs> oh my goodness so in case you guys are wondering yes I would love to start this I am rigged up I'm ready to throw my chains in the back but PD says we have to wait for clearance from the environmental company because of that tank. The tank that you can clearly see is off and to the side and spilled all over, but hey, I don't make the rules. I just abide by them. Like I said, at least by then, Joe will absolutely be done with this part. Joe, you're really earning that bonus. Alright. It's a wreck. And that right there is Man. proof that it's empty. I'm gonna fill it up and use it for a cake with beer. <laughs> <Hello>. <laughs> Alright, let me throw on my gloves and help you. Hold on. All right, guys, Joe did it. And just because it's dark doesn't mean it's late. To prove it, the TRX is still there. Or maybe that guy's slow, I don't know. But it is finally time. I am rigged up. I'll show him what you can do, Hulk. Beautiful, baby. Beautiful. More. Clutch or what? Sick. More. Free. We got it. I love that. Tanker tube, you did your job well. Very well.
Fly, baby, fly. Alright, I'm gonna stand on the other side and we're gonna rotate this. Alright. Alright, while Joe gets the land all in position on the other side, I can at least start to swing it. Ah, that's so cool. I'll leave it there to give Joe room to uh, get the land all on the other side. Perfect. Ready, go. Rotator? Yes, I am. Oh, damn. That is multitasking to the best ability out there. Thank you. I am impressed. People don't realize how difficult that is, but uh, it's pretty. I totally uh, I've mastered do. I totally that. Do. I, I appreciate it 100%. You've done this before. Done it a few times. I guess so. All right. Line it up perfect. Alright, let me... He's the one moving that Oh my god! I'm gonna be You wanna chain it, Joe? Alright, I'll put this down, let's chain it. Alright, now we're ready to finish the job. I think I'm gonna have to have Joe back up a bit. Joe, I think you're a little too far forward. Maybe not, we'll see. What do you think about the back? Well, we gotta get the fork in, but we gotta push it all the way forward. Okay. Um, Alright. It's as good as we're gonna get it, baby. So I drop out with the white. You wanna hold it up and I'll back up more? It'll be easier. Oh, you have to be swinging. Just pick it up a little bit and I'll back up. Mess, bro. Let's pick up the hood now while I have it here. Oh, this Landau's gonna need a washy wash. Hey, Joe, look. At least the drive shaft's out. Ah, <laughs> uh, tow truck humor. We are silly, silly. Hey, you're gonna have to help me pick it up. We're gonna have to set it completely down. Yeah? Yeah. All right, camera going down. All right, I helped Joe. We got the hood up. Now let me let out tension on all cables. See what that does, homie. Ah, uh, uh, what do you think, dog? Yeah, gangster, homie. I like that. Gangster, huh? You like that? I like that. This is how I roll. <laughs> Savage boy. This is how I roll. Ah, that's this cool. Look at that. I'll get those chains out. We'll strap up the hood and do a walk around because loose parts, man. Going all the way back to the freeway. We're in Encino right now. Good 30 minutes from my shop. You don't want any loose parts flying off.
What a mess. How'd it feel, Hulk? Ain't no thing. Hey, I got energy drinks. Check it out, Joe. Oh man, my fridge was open already. Woo -hoo. I'll take one of these babies. Look, more proof that it got dark quick and I'm fast. Fully disengaged, tying down the tractor, and the flatbed barely showed up to tow that Dodge out of the way. Nine side, they should have just done that from the get go, but hey, what do I know about light duty? Got all that nice and corrected. Just got to throw on some straps and Hulk's going to tow this baby out of here. Yes, Hulk tows. Believe it or not. Okay, that's a wrap. I need to finish doing the sweeping, but I don't need to record all that. We got the tractor fully secured and ready for takeoff. I got Hulk in tow mode. Using chain. Obviously the airlines are busted. You could see right there the where the glad hands would go to shoot air. Oh yeah. Not happening, buddy. I had to cage the brakes. Joe just finished securing the last of the uh, piece of wood. I'll throw my straps on. I already got the light bar. And then it's back to sunny Los Angeles. Sunny at 8 p.m. Light bar. Tired yet, Joe? Yeah. A little bit. Well, you That's better be ready now. for when we get the rollover after this. All right, guys. Hope you enjoy this cool little job. Peace. Hey, that's a hazmat, huh?